All right, so today we are going to make a creamy potato hamburger soup and you can make this in your Instant Pot or just on the stove top in a regular um, big pot. Um, to get started, we're gonna go ahead and saute up the garlic and the onion and the ground beef together until it's completely cooked. We're gonna go ahead and add the celery. Again, cook that down until it's a lot more translucent. Then we're gonna add our carrots and our diced potatoes. Um, once those are, um, and some, uh, the, our chicken broth here, sorry, I'm stumbling over my words. And then once that's nice and tender, we're gonna go ahead and add our seasonings and some salt and pepper. Um, and then towards the end, right before we serve this, we're gonna actually add some um, cream cheese and a little bit of cornstarch. We're gonna thicken that up with a little bit of milk and it's going to be super good, super hearty, just a classic soup that um, you can eat the next day, you know, warm it up for leftovers. And so I'm gonna go through that all with okay, you. So we're just gonna saute this up once it gets to heat. You're gonna see that um, this is all going to get sizzling hot and it's gonna cook down into a translucent color. And then we'll go ahead and add our ground beef and continue cooking that. Then we'll add our celery and our carrots and then our potatoes and our chicken broth before we add our soup. And here is our soup just boiling away. And once those are nice, soft and tender, we'll add, this is all garlic here. Um, we'll add the cream cheese and milk with, um, thicken that up. And then we'll add our spices like the uh, fresh basil and um, I actually added a little bit of nutmeg in here because I really like just a splash of nutmeg. It adds a, um, another flavor to your soups. Um, so that's it. Our soup is done. You can see the nice basil in there and all the chunky vegetables, nice hearty flavor. And just a wee taste of that nutmeg just kind of throws it into yummy goodness.